Well, first things first. I got this face. I love it. I'm not going to use that one, I don't think. But it gives me an idea. What the heck? I went online and, and found several photographs that could help. Uh, this one here with the helmet on. He's not old, but that helmet is interesting. And I got several old Norse men spaces. And, uh, but I, I'm not happy with this guy. I mean, come on. It's starting to be a caricature instead of a something serious here. And I'm not making cartoons. I'm making, a, hopefully, a sculpture. Time to play with some clay. So I'm going to, uh, let's see, get my right tool here. First off, I'm going to take the eyes off. Hey, this this head's too small for these eyes. These eyes are too big. They look kind of funny, but that's not what I'm going for. I'm not going for funny. Although I could. <laughs> it just all depends how this turns out. And never be wedded to one idea you got to be willing to take it apart if you think it's not working and that wasn't working For those of you who follow me on YouTube, they know for a fact that I don't always stick with the first try. Just filling it in. Um, you got to do some research tonight on clothing. Um, just got to figure something out here. But right now, I'm just going to fill in this part with clay. I'm happy with how it's turning out. Um, got to push this aluminum foil in a little bit. There we go. Yeah.
hurts. Hmm. Okay. All right, I think I came up with an idea for what to do with his uh, arms. And uh, I'm going to have a battle axe resting across this area here. And I've just got to figure out if this is long enough for the handle. It's going to obviously go down uh, into uh, off the uh, design or the whatever. But uh, I think that'll be a good one. Um, I didn't want to really put a shield on him, and uh, I'm thinking this might be a good way to get around that. That's going to mean me having to sculpt these hands really good, which is uh, going to be a challenge, but I'm up to the challenge. What the heck? But I think, it, I think it'll look good, and uh, yeah, he's an axe man. All right. Be right back. Oh, that hurts my thumb. Oh, God. Oh, man. To be young again, have hands of a young man again. Oh, my goodness. That would be a dream. Ow! It's the weather. But anyway. Okay, I gotta plot out his ribs. Oh, it hurts. Okay. Let me get my calipers. Now, a lot of the chest is probably going to have beard on it, but I'm just going to go ahead and do this anyway. And uh, plot out the size of the ribs. And uh, that's too big. All right, I've got uh, this carried away pretty much okay. It's uh, I got one more rib to put on this side here, and then I got a couple more down here. I've got to fill in a little bit so they got some something to uh, sit on. But I'm liking uh, the uh, character of this 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 uh, Viking, this old Viking. He's bent over. Um, with age, but also because of the uh, heavy weapon that he carried, the uh, battle axe that uh, he'll have crook in the crook of his arm. He can't really hold it with one hand anymore like he used to. I guess he's got to be old to understand what old feels like and uh i'm 74 and i can feel it <laughs> every day i can feel it but i'm liking it i'm liking the face a lot better it's more proportional to the body i like the long uh neck and uh he's gonna be sinewy but uh still strong enough to pick up the axe but not quite as strong as he was when he was young. 
All right. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Give me a thumbs up and share my video. And then check out my instructional DVDs, uh, the link down below this video. All right. See you next time.